Hello, Mr. Nguyen here. Welcome back to Warcraft Total War version 2.3. We are playing as the Blood Elves and the Naga in a hot seat campaign. We are attacking Stratholm. We played this battle before, but it crashed when we had almost won the battle because I had a third person mod on and it conflicted with the, I believe, the Medieval Total War and the Oral Project tool. If we have uh, the camera zoomed in on a hero and then switch between running and walking, and sometimes we will crash due to the same button for switching running to walking and walking to running being used by the M2V UP tool for different uh, hot seat related features where you can save the battle and then use it in custom battle or something anyway uh, usually it shouldn't crash if we do not have the camera zoomed in on the character but for some reason it did I had played almost the entire battle so yeah, it was because I tried to switch from walking to running. I didn't want to play the battle, I was gonna just out win it, but we have new voices for the High Elves and Blood Elves here. Uh, just like we had with the Night Elves earlier, and we also have it for the Kingdom of Lordaeron. Okay, for the humans of the Kingdom of Lordaeron. So, uh, that means that Lordaeron will have custom voices for the humans and for the High Elves, but not for the Dwarves. Okay, uh, and uh, because they have dwarves in their armor too. Okay, uh, unless um, Tucker One added dwarven voices for their dwarven units, but I don't think so. But we'll see. Anyway, we will fight this battle. Balance of power, army strength ratio 3 2 in our favor. The enemy is Baron Rivendar of the Scourge, or the Undead, as they were known in Warcraft 3. Scourge in, in, uh, in uh, World of Warcraft. They have 2187 Undead. Mostly basic and medium troops. They have some dangerous units too. We have Arisa, Lord of Terror. Arisa Windrunner. The, the Lord of Terror title is from Medieval 2, I believe, due to a trait. And it reminds me of Diablo 2 Lord of Destruction, as I said in the other video. Um, so it looks, uh, sounds kind of funny. Uh, Arisa, Lord of Terror. Like Diablo, Lord of Terror. Anyway. Uh, we uh, are backed up by an army of Captain uh, Kaidanis of the Blood Elves. He has 272 Blood Elven troops. Reset 1794 Elves. And then we have Krillian and Naga backup force with 633 Naga. We don't want them to be manually under our control because they did nothing previously when we clicked on them to attack. If we do not have this selected, maybe they will be entirely controlled by the AI and may do something. We'll see. Start the battle. Anara Labalori. So it will be the Kingdom of Icana custom settlement from Harul to Lore again, used by the Scourge. It looks kinda like an Aztec inspired building. In Hyrule Total War, it's a cursed uh, settlement of an undead faction, so it fit the scourge. Okay. But it's a Hyrule settlement, and it has the same texture as the Hyrule settlement, too. Okay. We must it's the capital of the Kingdom of Icana in Hyrule Total War. It looks exactly the same. Okay. It's used by some of the scourge buildings, settlements. We had pretty much won this battle previously. So this siege is worthless, we can't attack the walls with it. We have a new ready to fight. Male voice here. My men are ready to fight. Let's move quickly. Alright. So uh Tuck it one even added chanting and, and comments when we have the camera on the unit as you can hear they say for Quel'Thalas instead of for the Blood Elves so I guess uh, he added voices for the high elves of Quel'Thalas, 
kingdom of Quel'Thalas and uh, then use the same for the Blood Elves. So that's why they say Quel'Thalas instead of the Sindori. Okay. Let's move quickly. Outstanding. Move quickly, my warriors. So yeah, it's the Quel'Thalas uh, voices. Your magic is mine. My men are ready to fight. It shall be done. It shall be done. I'll do my best. It shall be done. I'll do my best. Male, the males have the same voices. Let's move. Same. So when we order the female unit, the blood trade, to move, they have the same voices as the Night Elven Archers. Same. High Elves in World of Three use the same voices as the, the Archers of the Night Elves. So it makes sense. All too easy. They should have chanting too, I think. Unit. Let's move quickly. My men are ready to fight. Foul Let's move game. quickly. Let's move quickly. My men are ready to fight. It shall be done. Outstanding. Uh, this is the bodyguard. That's why it doesn't work. It has the generic sound, the male sound. He said they had problems. Um, adding voices to the bodyguards. So that's very easy with our bodyguard. Slaughter our enemies. These are the night the the high elven archers or blood elven archers. Elves are not easy prey. You'll regret ever ending my chance. Let's none I can hit a bird in the eye, flying. We elves are not easy prey. I will teach you restraint. We elves are not easy prey. I can hit a bird in the eye. <coughs> Seems the archers and the rangers have the same voices. I can hit a bird in the to eye. The lying. Cry. To the to the death. Death. To the death. Really like that he has added the uh, chanting. The night elves didn't have that. They would gladly add these chantings to the night elves too. They should fit pretty well. You'll regret ever entering my forest. Of course, the bodyguard doesn't sound right. Okay, and so, so male voices for the males and uh, female voices for the females. <coughs> and uh, the female generals on the map have unique voices and KL has his own unique one. Okay, uh, so we can uh, control the hero in battle. I'll do my best. They may want to group our troops first. We elves are not. We elves are not. Close formation, two rows. Mr. Mavdeer. Good 
face. Okay, and then the infantry. And the rams could still be used, of course. This time we attacked with the ram. I believe in the previous battle we did not have any rams. We took the other pass, the infantry and rangers that can enter here. Then enter the walls or enter here. So we sacrificed all the infantry here. Then um, we had the enemy actually sally out. And then we killed them from afar because they couldn't open up this gate for some reason. And then they were shot at until there were like one or two, three maybe still standing. Then it crashed because I tried to switch from walking to running. I wanted to play a little bit as the, the hero of Arisa and crashed. Yeah, okay, so um, now we have rams because previously I started the battle thinking, I believe in the previous video, thinking that the siege bow could be used to destroy the wall, but it didn't work. This siege engine is only against troops, can't damage walls or gates, so we needed rams to destroy the gate. Now we have a ram though, so we will certainly attack the gate. <coughs> okay, infantry. Place them over there. Lose formation. Didn't work. Okay. Uh, we will place this one here. Move quickly, my warriors. And uh, cavalry could be one group. I don't think we will have to use the cavalry, but if if they sell out with their cavalry, we might have to use them. Defend, use them against their death knights. And our siege bow, which is totally worthless against gates, so we can only use it against the troops. Okay, um, and now we will start up the, t the third person mod because I enjoy using it. during the night. Okay. And I think we can move it down to 2 a.m. No, not 2 a.m. But certainly 3. Maybe 2.45 or... No, I think In this 15th part, I am showing off Tucket 1's new High Slash Blood Elven custom voices on the strat map. He has finished High Slash Blood Elves and the Kingdom of Lordaeron since completing the Kaldori Slash Night Elves earlier in January. He did finish the Elves and Lordaeron during February 2023. Unfortunately, the battle became the Naga conquest of the Trade Coalition uh, Slash Goblin capital of Undermine have to wait for the next video to be able to hear the new blood that high eleven voices in battle. Yeah. Okay, this uh, sea guy in general was kind of bugged. Don't know why we loaded the sea guy and as the hero. Anyway, uh, let's 
go to the third person mode start it and return to the game we are controlling the seven runner here we have some vanilla male voices chanting too but they fit kinda uh, the male units okay start the battle Enforcement Captain Kaldanis. He will control these units too. We will not get any reinforcements until we lose troops. And they will enter and reinforce. We also have our Naga ally. They should be entirely under AI control now. So as soon as we have opened the gate, they will be able to attack. Seems they couldn't attack through the extra gate. The Allied Army is the Naga Force, but they consist only of Murlocs and Sea Witch officers. Okay, we will attack the gate here. Looks formation with the crew. Slightly bugged animation with this general because she's using the I believe Kalori Sword Masters, the Sindori Sword Masters as the near general, and that unit is taller, so that's why she is kind of glitched. We would like to switch that unit to the Rangers, maybe so she would use the Rangers, the general instead, and she would look perfect. But that has been done. Yeah, the, the model is a bit glitched. She's not using the. She's not the generic general. We can also lower this to 66. It's easier to hear what I'm saying. See the bodyguard is not bugged. Elven Rangers. That's because they have their own animation. Unlike the hero. That is using the animations of a different unit. Because it have to look a little bit odd. On. Open the gate. There are two gates. We'll need to destroy this gate too. But the banshees can fire through the wall, I believe. So we will need to be careful there. We also have a lot of zombies and other stuff here. Cavalry. How exhilarating! <coughs> Kaltas or Prince Kaltas is the narrator for the High and Blood Elves too. <coughs> Just like Tyrande is for for the Night Elves or Kadorai. I don't know which uh, character is the narrator for the Lordran faction. Probably Artas, but Prince Artas, but could be um, the Paladin Uther too or someone else. Sure, we'll have to try it out later. This Prince Kaltas for the High and Blood Elves, and it's <coughs> Moon Priestess Tyrand. She's a cool leader of the faction, the Night Elves. Can fast forward. Battering ram. Now you will taste true power. All right. Yeah, Prince Kaltas doesn't sound very nice. I mean, he he doesn't sound very good. 
is actually very initial. He wants vengeance on the scourge and others. He's doing the right thing for his people, but he is kind of evil. Uh, in an alliance with the Nag and the demons, the Burning Legion. Can't attack the other gate, I believe. Due to them having banshees, I believe. Mages. Let's attack the rangers. So a bunch is here. Maybe others too. Right, we will march in with the rangers first. Try to use them against the banshees. They have very long range. We'll see if they can do it or if they will be killed. Especially with no old animations. The unit is obviously based on Sylvanas Windrunner, leader of the Forsaken. High Elf in Kvaltala's army before she was killed by Ortes and turned into an undead. Then she broke free and became the leader of the Forsaken, which is like a rebel undead faction. Okay, so they moved over there. Undead are moving their troops. Now the Banshees have moved over there. Actually, we, we might send in. Uh, stop that, and we will. Would send in the infantry. I think we will uh, send these troops through this entrance again. Still moving. No, they have stopped moving, but they probably need us to open the second gate before they start moving. Pikeman and the infantry again. Okay. Yeah, we prefer attacking through this entrance with the infantry, so they can avoid being shot at. Against their troops. 
the other side of the gate. We can't destroy the second gate before we have taken care of their ban trees. My men are ready to fight. These guys do, but not the rogues. Mm. So there might be some edits needed to add that. I believe I changed the voice uh, type from heavy to light, and that gave them sound when we select them to move. All too easy. But uh, not the selection sound. Another file will need to be modified Hold on. for that. Annoying. Okay. Because the elves they speak when we select them too. Elves are not easy prey. You'll regret ever entering my forests. We elves are not. Yeah. Easy. They want this sound um, for the blood trades too. I can hit a bird in the eye. Okay. Or similar. My men are ready to fight. I will continue Hyrule to the War 2. We'll need to restart the Kingdom of Hyrule campaign again. It's fine. I don't know if I will uh, record from the start or if I will play until we arrive here and then start recording. We'll see. We'll also make an episode of each Hyrule to the War faction, except maybe the Dick Scrubs. I never liked the Dick Scrubs. Well, the units are cool. I wouldn't enjoy playing as them. They are too small and too numerous. <coughs> Uh, but uh, most factions there are interesting. Just not the deck scrubs. For me at least. Certainly want to make an episode. Um, one episode per faction with the intro videos. All the factions with the intro videos you get at least one episode. The problem with the moblins is that they have a very small screen. I would like the, the video to have a wide screen first, but then I would need to remake it. And, um, it's like uh, the processing of the video took forever. I don't know. <coughs> oh, they reached this area now. the hold up. Need them to be in formation. What's the hold up? Goals. The sergeants. I need to add some more voices to the blood shades. It's more fun when they speak when you select them. Okay, I believe uh, Target 1 added uh, the voices to every unit except a few that he forgot because he was fucked. Uh, the, the banshees. Uh, 
Detect error. Attack. Hope they don't die before they reach the enemy. <coughs> Some of them will die. <coughs> they were 13, now we are only 8. Well done. Let us press onward. I didn't want to arrange units. Attack to now, my warrior. Nearly a setback. They're idiots. Who entered there? Move back. I wanted them to fire. What the fuck are they doing? Disable skirmish mode. I don't know why they decided to attack in melee and be steamrolled by their cavalry. That's what they wanted. I will lose the entire unit of rangers. That wasn't good. somewhere and fire at them. Not move in into the middle of fight Thank you. 
not for it. I did really dislike what happened to my ranger unit. Just a shame that he, he went for the Quelt last voices and not the Sakura voices. I always prefer the, the Blood Elves or the, the High Elves. Anyway. Shall we tear the enemy asunder? Yes, we shall. Oh, we have the blood blades there too. Dismounted blood knights. It's a door eye. There's a little death knight you here. Give that one too. Five percent enemy skill, seven percent ally skill. Yeah, this battle still went better. Probably because we have a lot of archers firing on them too. More effort this time. Because I need the archers sooner. And all the infiltrate ones instead of one unit at a time. Well done. Let us press onward. Better than I told you. I love the sound of the female units chanting. Did I'm an awesome idea. Those shall burn in the light of the sun! Yes, they shall. Okay, we need to check what happened with the ranger. Did they go up to the wall? Some of them did. Good. They are firing. Perfect. Good job, soldiers. Okay, we want our infantry to attack. Deeper. This two should attack. They'll go this way. Foot 
Footman. Hi, Alvin Footman. In this case, this is Laura Footman. Alvin Footman is the name. Yeah. Here we have the archers. Elven archers, they are firing too. They did what the rangers were supposed to do. Good job, Elven archers. Continue to fire. So this is the Battle of Stratform again. Used a much better uh, attempt at playing the battle. There we have the volunteers, Elven volunteers. The militia. They're also attacking this way. Sending in all the infantry at once. Very good. Have uh, shield wall on with the footman, and the close formation, tight formation. Ah, so. No lag this time. I had forgotten to put on a an external fan. Now it's on. It helps with lagging. Even the computer is too hot, uh, it lags a little bit. Uh, thanks to the fan, it's not as hot, you know. So the lag kind of disappears. This is too easy. This one is based on a hero, actually. The blue band, the chief, and the main model of the mod. They move that you uh, shoulder pads and such to make her more generic. Uh, yeah, it was a mistake. We should have kept uh, the hero too. We could have added the hero as a custom character. Yeah, I will probably still add this one as a custom character, but relax a few details of the hero, like unique shoulder pads, I believe. The blonde one was the, the original model. Dead here. I love the uh, animations when they jump around and such. Fuck, she died. Dead, another one died. Much better battle because of the archers doing their job at once. We kill 97% of the enemy. 20% allies killed. Really good. Well done. Let us press onward. Very good. Dead. Oh, our ally, the Naga ally, the Murlocs have arrived now too. They entered. So this time they didn't uh, just stand outside, but aided us in the battle. Perfect. At least some of the Murlocs. Maybe all of them have entered now. Charge. Kill the banshees now. I'm dead elves. I'm dead night elves. Good. Kill that one too. So yeah, this battle went much better. Killing them. General kill 99% of the enemy, lost 25% of our troops and ally, our allies' troops. We have some dismounted death knights over there, too. What the fuck? It crashed. But 
but at the same time that thing showed up so it must be, must be because of it the fucking shit I had won the battle we will auto win this battle now I don't care okay but it probably crashed because that thing showed up at in the corner there so uh, I will need to shut down all the other browsers and such so we don't get interrupted in the game like that of course we won't lose anything now because I'm using the Nvidia Shadow Play recorder to record and it records the, the screen uh, so even when it crashes it continues to record you can see the symbol in the upper left uh, corner so we are still recording video start 6 minutes alright uh, that sucked I really liked how that battle went we had pretty much won it fair and square for the second time and this time it was fucking epic and then something showed up and it crashed despite using the tool it can still crash with the tool, it should happen randomly but in battle, but uh, it can still happen unfortunately that's not the right one this one is <laughs> okay, um, so we were using the M2 to the VEP tool this one and it still crashed but it shouldn't happen often and, and I believe it was triggered by that uh, thing in the, that showed up at the same time I run away Warcraft War Everything went right in that battle. Yeah, we will we will have no choice but to auto win it. If we auto resolve, we might lose it, and I don't accept the loss. And we have won it two times. Well, we can try to auto win, uh, auto resolve it. But if we lose, we will load again and auto win it. Problem with auto winning it is that we will have no uh, losses. So it's a bit like cheating. Maybe it was the Marlox that caused the crash too, it could be. Marlox have crashed in the past due to their numbers. For some reason they are unstable and, and the Marlox did take part in that battle, so it could be the Marlox too caused the crash. The video starts <coughs> in less than three minutes or on YouTube. The, the prior video. Alright, done. We need to load the sound. So if we auto resolve what happens, crushing the feet, we can't accept that. We need to load again. 
Don't accept it. I've won the battle two times now. But had I crash it at the end. I believe it crashed because of the Murlocs. Them together with the elves and the scourge. Too many. I don't know why, but uh, the, the, the Murloc units tend to crash way more than any other unit in the mod. Okay, we don't want to replay that battle, so we'll do this. Okay, clear victory. Risa, Windrunner, we we'll say Windrunner because this title is probably vanilla due to the trait. Risa Windrunner had 1294 elves. No, 1794 elves. Lost 22. Yeah, we lost almost no one because of out winning it. So oh. it doesn't really count. None may threaten the elf lands. We elves are not easy prey. Alright. Yes, my friend. We hardly Leave lost anyone. So we'll, um, the way I see it, can accept losing the these guys. We can accept Get losing on with it. the militia. And uh, yes, my can friend. accept losing two units of militia here too. Okay, the others were still Get alive to some it. degree. We lost quite a yes, few of friend. them, but Get on with yeah. it. Yes, no my way to, to remove a few it. of them. Yeah, we don't want to remove the entire unit. Courage and honor, trusted friends. Uh, the God bless, noble allies. I'm pretty sure. Marbles. I have a land to defend. Get on with it. Stratum. Reese, so the video starts in two minutes. Okay. I can also destroy this unit. Nine remaining. We elves are not easy prey. Get on with it. Leave a unit of archers there. You're allied to the Scarlet Crusade. To the Naga. Or the Scourge down dead and the King Alliance Flodern, Kingdom Flodern, uh, and the uh, Amani Trolls. So, where will we strike next? I think we'll go for Serdara. Uh, Come taste the wrath of the elves. I can hit a bird in the eye flying. Higher. Some highwaymen. Yes, my friend. Get on with it. Yes, Send my friend. Siege boat Easily too. done. Easily done. Your wish is my command. Ooh, Without delay. Diplomat. Help me. Help you. You so shall I can continue to spy over there. Yeah, we could I use here. female voices for this bloodland spy. For now, this practice. I am the iron hand of justice. Name thy target, sire. Let the hunt begin. Okay, we used the assassin there and destroyed the building successfully. She, she didn't fail. So the fleet of the blood elves still have vanilla voice lines. Okay. Settlement. Repair. If you build it, you don't need undead buildings to. You can destroy the undead structure. Can't destroy that for some reason. Go 
for an elven fort here. So Varisa's army is moving towards Serdaro. Yes, we also my need friend. to be careful about the trolls. They look weak here, but if we attack this place where they have Warlord Sulin, for Mani tribe, their leader, then they will have a garrison script spawning an entire army. So we need more than one army there. Get on with it. We have two custom generals. Get on with it. Think yes, what my we friend. need to do is we need to move uh, an army over here. Leave it to me. Uh, yes, my friend. Get on with it. Easily done. Be quick. Time is man. Get on with it. This general could lead instead. In air general. Easily done. The bodyguard of the blood mages. Okay, and then I'll do my best. Yeah. Yes, my friend. Prince Keltas. We can have him. Dear. I feel edgy. Get on and with it. Uh, move on unit to the capital as garrison. So this is Regent Lord Lord Mad Air. And this is a different character. Very similar portraits. Yes, my friend. Send cavalry unit. To Get Galtas. on, we should move soon. No, Kaltas has a full sized army, but we need Get cavalry on with unit. it. Yes, my this friend. Force them. Easily done. Yes, my friend. Get no, on with we had it. A full unit there. I was wrong. There's no room. We'll build some stuff. We'll build an elven dockyard. Silver Moon. And in Sunset and George, we'll go for the elven drill square to get troops. Right, we're done with construction uh, of buildings. Uh, so, Sunset and Chorage. I don't think we need troops right now. We'll just end the turn. Be back in the Naga turn. So, I decided to make two videos instead of having just one with both the Naga battle and the blood alone battle because uh, it took an entire day between me going to eat breakfast and continuing this so now we're in the middle of the night I believe um, it's uh, Wednesday night and uh, when I played the other episode it was in the morning of uh, I believe uh, Tuesday so I decided to make the two different videos Okay, the video is up and running. Your orders, number one. Yeah, we are controlling the nag and uh Yes Can't move over the bridge. Okay, what about the other areas? We are totally bankrupt. Orders? I thought we had a deal with the blood elves to get one. Uh, yeah, paying you 8,000 florins in tribute per turn. Okay. Yes, my lord. Your orders? So we'll send the Naga army somewhere. We will send them yes, towards my lord. that ire. Conquer it. Yes. We'll send another one. But to this ire. Full sail. Your will. Joining the fleet. Okay, so the nano. Uh, we shall one continue there. tomorrow, my lord. Can't do anything more. It's nice that the turns, the end turns are much faster in this mode compared to Hyrule Turn 4. So that's at least one good thing here. A 
fewer factions and way fewer scripts. Okay. Yep, the T skill will be built. Relations first and lines of lore are very poor. Lines enhanced. Cast mode and dwarves and the forsaken undead. That was Savannah's Windrunner, the sister of Arisa Windrunner that we used control this this woman. I have a land to defend. Okay. Don't know, they might have a garrison script if they attack there. So it might be too dangerous. They might want to attack a different area. Do you require aid? Your wish is my command. The flows of We elves are not easy prey. Okay, we might move down there. Fair enough. We have strong guard. Neutral faction. They have a huge arm here too. General family member Randall Valutar. No traits whatsoever. He's not a an important character. He's a near general. They're I have too a strong to here. Defend. We don't want to fight them. Yes, my friend. This guy too. Leave it to me. Get on with it. An honor, blessed move. ally. Okay, nothing to construct. Tranquilian Castle. Can go for some volunteers. We have hardly any money to so no. We will just um, continue to move. Get These on troops. with it. Easy My men are ready to fight, my lord. And uh, Prince Kaltas will move too. You shall move do. the spy. We should move soon. I'll do my best. Yes, my friend. Get on and with this it. This cavalry unit, I think, is needed. Easily done. My men are ready to fight, my lord. Get on with it. Be gone, spawn of darkness. They shall burn. I'll do my best. It shall be done. So I can attack this immediately the thanks to the siege engine, but it doesn't really work. We'll need to wait one turn before we can attack. We are attacking with two armies. One under a generic general. Yes, my friend. General Quellis, Cloudbreaker. The Bladdles. Move soon. Or, I, or and Prince Keltas. The champion, we will place him. He is the leader of the faction. Prince of the Sindori. Okay. So, there is a and I will have to move a different I am the pass. Ranger General of this land. We'll move her towards the Forsaken, probably. We are not at all with the Forsaken, I think. We want to attack the Scourge, but I think they have a garrison script here. We could try attack it. We'll see. Let's end the turn. We're back on the Naga turn. We can't do much because they are bankrupt. Okay. Scourge is the strongest military in this overall strongest faction, the Casmode and Dwarves. These are good dwarves, they are the largest have the largest population. The Night elves of the Kaldori, they have the best production in the world and the horde has the best financial situation. Okay. Yes, my lord. Floating Attack course now, my lord. Your orders? Could just end the turn. They will move automatically. Right presented? No, we are not interested. <laughs> uh, okay. Training complete in Solar Cell. Solar Cell, we have archers. That's good. So we're holding this area still. It's kind of revolting. We'll probably lose it. We have an element port constructed. Is stalled. Okay. We elves are not easy prey. Just attack these guys. None may threaten the elf lands. 
Anara la Bellori. You'll regret ever in my life. Attack without them getting. They got some backups, but they had almost a full sized army. They got some extra troops. And we lay siege to the area. We can attack. I think we'll do that. So we'll fight this battle. In the next episode. Play the game. And see you in the next episode. So the Sindori or Blood Elves. Risa Windrunner. It's an army of 793 Blood Elves. And she is facing the undead or the scourge. Captain Morbidus has 2596 undead. He spawned a few. He have no general, which is good. He spawned mostly basic troops, medium troops. Balance of power, arm strength, ratio 5 4 in our favor. Okay, so we are leading. We could probably win. It's a citadel, I believe. So they will probably have the same settlement type as Ice Crown. Which is the Shadow Temple, Harut's War Settlement, which is the capital of the Undead in Undead Stalfos in Harut's War. Okay, but in Harut's War it's just a fort, unfortunately. Okay, um, here it's used by the Scourge, it's their huge city and citadel level sit settlements. We also have unique texture, a unique texture for the Warcraft one, Warcraft version. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye.